if you want to have wonder, why not abundant wonder? It's better than a little bit of measly wonder. The exhibition is called Abundant Wonder because I like more, because I want to see a lot of different things. Maybe perhaps because my name is Tom Moore and more is more. Don't believe the less is more people. You'll probably notice wandering around the exhibition that there are lots of flames, glass flames, on lots of the objects. One of the reasons for that is just a simple reminder that all of these things are made from fire. I'm very familiar with being quite close to furnaces and very hot flame. It's something that isn't apparent when you find cold glass. Glass is extremely different when it's hot and runny and moving. If only we could exhibit it when it was still turning and moving, it would be really something to see. But as it is, these objects are cold. Partly, I think it's funny to see a glass flame, and it's really funny to make a glass flame with fire, but I want to remind people that glass is the product of a transformation of materials through fire and it's a fundamental metamorphosis and it sort of harkens back to the way that a lot of these characters are also metamorphic hybrids of different other life forms mashed together. Some of the things which are burning are funny and some of them are a little alarming, some of them are probably a little didactic. So to see coral on fire, I think is quite a shocking, but also a little bit obvious. Please forgive that. And there are some things which were made during the bushfires in early 2020. Images in the news, like the woman who took off her shirt to rescue a singed koala. And the, you'll notice in the paperweights that there is a koala that is on fire.